Hello guys and welcome you to my live tutorials where today's tutorial is very recommended by those who want to increase their their uh, blog comments especially from Facebook it facilitates for people to comment directly from Facebook and not to filling all those required information in the uh, in the uh, blogger uh, comments box provided so it is very a very easy way you don't have to search for the you don't have to go to the, the to the XTML or something as such and search for things no it's very easy all you need to do is follow two easy steps now let's just go st get started for example this is my blog I want to insert the comment box under this post the Facebook comment box here under this post so how to do that so first things first l go to this website which I will uh, mention the link down below once you do that you copy the URL of your blog of the overall blog I mean not a specific page all right, so here you paste it here, as you can see, and then for the width, they will give you 550 as you know suggestion, which is good. Now the number of posts that will appear once people comment, so the maximum number is five. And here, sourced by the oldest or sourced by the newest, depends on you. All right. So now you've done all that, click on get code. Okay, once you do that, follow the instructions. Include the JavaScript on your page once, ideally right after the opening body tag. Okay, so what we're gonna do is simply copy this overall text here and go to our blogger to the layout okay so here we are going to add the HTML JavaScript gadget click on click on add a gadget and select the HTML JavaScript hit plus okay you've got this window now you paste what we've copied before paste it here and click on save now after you've done all that, click save arrangements or you may want to drag this uh, our JavaScript, our new JavaScript created. Just drag it here under the body post, the blog post. Okay, And then click on save arrangements. Now if you don't have the ability to drag it under this a blog post for those who may have a pre-made template so it's not a problem just keep it here however in my next video I will show you how to add and how to enable the addition of uh, of gadgets whatever you want even in a uh, pre-made template okay so stay tuned now once you've done all that click on save arrangements yes and then what we have to do is to go back again to the website to the uh, Facebook developer and copy this uh, code now as you can see here if you want to change the width it is 550 you, you only have to uh, modify this number okay it depends on the layout on the um, size of the template you're using so we have copied this code we go to our blog and posts now for example I want to add as you can see here they said in YouTube uh, in uh, Facebook sorry place this code wherever you want the plugin to appear on your page so I want the plugin to appear for example under this post so let's click edit yes and select the HTML edition 
Now all you need to do is to paste the code brought from Facebook, paste it here. And just up to it, write the following br and then slash br. Okay, I think that's all. So here it is called documents related to the training view. Yeah, and here it is. So as you can see here, it appears even above the uh, usual blogger comments box. So as you can see, the width doesn't really fit me, so I'm going to change it. Click on Edit. I'm going to go with, with a higher number, higher width, so 450 would be better, or or uh, 500. 400. Okay. So for those, uh, for this link, I recommend that you just copy it and paste it, for example, in your notes here. So you may just copy it and paste it when, whenever you write a new post. So yeah, here is a good box and you can comment on it, for example, thank you. Yeah, as you can see here. And of course you can just adjust it in the way you want, for example, edit to the post, delete it as you want, delete the comment, sorry. Yeah, so that's it. And now you have your own box. People will mostly uh, rely on this type of commenting tool, let's say. Well, that's all for today, guys. Thank you very much for watching. I hope this video was informative. If you like the video and it works for you, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to receive uh, more videos about blogger and blogger edition and tips and hints. So. So guys, uh, for those who were not able to to add this uh, Facebook box because of the layout or because they didn't, they were not able to drag that JavaScript gadget under the body section. So it's not a problem. In my next tutorial, I'll be showing you how to add gadget sections, whatever you want in your layout, even it's even if it's pre-made. So we are going to make some changes at the level of the template. So yeah, that's